I just started using this one. It's called Piano Bar, and it is a command line uh, player for Pandora, the streaming music service, which is free. Okay, so you do need an account, so go create one. And after that, uh, this program is in your repository, so just search for Piano Bar, and you will find it. All right, but to use this, uh, you know, just type in the name of it, Piano Bar, push enter, and then you type in your username which is usually your email uh, right there and then password and then you log in right this is um, what was that uh, my they call it stations or something like that so if I wanted to play well let me mute it first because I don't want to get copyright stuff but so if I wanted to play um, yeah let's say number four Madonna right and it will play like um, artist that's similar to hers so you see it started playing right here uh, the timer right here right um, if you want to go next hit N or if you don't know like the high keys for this um, what you do is you know the question mark you have to hold shift and then hit the question mark and they give you a list of uh, high keys you can use so you can love the song a band the song whatever um, if you want to create a new station, uh, right here it says C, right? So you hit C, and then you look for an artist. Uh, let's say you look for, I don't know, Lady Gaga. All right, and then it's gonna tell me if this uh, is a artist or a track name. So it's an artist. So hit A, and they give you a few uh, lists here, um, and then you just tell it, you know, zero, one, two, three, or four, or whatever. So we say zero because it was Lady Gaga, and there you go. You added the list. Now if you want to switch, uh, change stations. Um, this one is to change stations. We are S. So you hit S, and now you have Lady Gaga uh, on number four here. So you hit four, and I'll you know play the Lady Gaga radio station, which is playing Poker Face right now. And there's some other high keys. So let me give you an example. If you want to, I don't know, pause it, you hit P here and next. They don't have previous because that's just how it works, you know. Uh, you can only go to the next song, you can't go backwards. That's just how Pandora does it. And what else you can do? Uh, you know, all this stuff right here. Remember, is the high key for this is well, shift and then the question mark. And I'll show you a list of all the high keys you can do. And after that, if you want to quit, you just press Q and it'll quit. And there you go. Now the way you know how you start up Piano Bar, and he always asks you for a password and all that. Well, if you don't want to, uh, you know, type in your password every time. Let me show you how to do that also. So what you want to do is go to your home folder, and uh, Control H if you're on GNOME, but if we're on KDE, is Alt and period, and you can show all your hidden files. Uh, and then you look for dot config. What is it? What the hell is it here? I said dot config. What the hell? Um, what the hell is that? There you go. This is the folder. All right. Dot config folder. Go in here. Uh, if they don't have the folder piano bar, you can just make it yourself. So create new folder and type in piano bar okay now let's go inside it and we're gonna create a new file uh, text file here and you want to call this is config and inside this one uh, just to open it here let's close that what you want to do is type in your username and password like this so user uh, equals and then you know your email address blah 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 and then password and you put equals and then your password whatever it is right so that's just really all you gotta do in here and then you save it and then uh, next time uh, when you start up the piano bar from the command line uh, it will work so let me not show you my password but I already made a config file I'm just gonna replace it one second so here's my config file. I'm just going to drag it over into uh, Piano Bar here. 
and it has my password in it, in it and everything so if I do this and let me clear this so if I start piano bar now it should automatically log in All right. there you go you don't have to type in your password or anything um, and it has all my information already and if I want to play it just start playing it you know really quick so that's it for this one piano bar from the command line if you want to you know listen to Pandora radio or Pandora music uh, I don't believe it shows any ads uh, I mean like audio ads I didn't really hear any so if that's your concern maybe they have it I'm not sure that's it for this one